uh, there in this video i will explain you uh, different uh, adb commands that can be used to automate the android device so here is the list of some of the commands that uh, can be used so i'm gonna execute some of the commands on this android phone so let us start first is adb devices so this command is used to list the attached devices uh, through the usb and if here the usb is enabled or uh, all the it also displays all the android emulators as well so right now there is only one device and that's my android phone so this adb devices just uh, used to list down the devices that are attached to this particular uh, adb server and next thing is like next commands is like adb install and the apk file name so if this command can be used to install the android application the next one is adb pull and the name of the file so this command is used to uh, like download the uh, some file from the device android device or the android phone to your uh, local uh, computer then adb shell input text in index so command to enter the value in the uh, text box can be used this one so let me show you how you can do that so let's say this is your phone and you want to enter something in here so for that what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna execute this command from this one so adb shell input text and here I can put any text say apm and then hit enter so this will actually send this uh, text to the uh, text box that is displayed on the phone so as you can see it is uh, it has typed apm in that uh, text box so that's how you can uh, use this uh, input text adb shell input text command to uh, send the text to the uh, android phone so similarly there are other commands as well for example uh, to start some activity you can use adb shell am activity manager start this activity on the phone then to list the packages uh, within the device or the emulator you can use this adb shell pm list packages so i'm gonna execute this command as well adb shell pm list packages so this is used to list down all the packages or the applications from the android phone so let us hit enter and then it will uh, list down all the packages so these are all the applications actually or the package names that are installed in this particular android phone like com.sec.android.app.ringtone.vr etc so all the application has got the package name and then these package names are listed down using this command so adb shell pm uninstall com dot uh, the application name so this command can be used to uninstall the app taking the screenshot to take the screenshot you can use this one adb shell screen cap and over here you can give the name uh, path where you want to uh, save that screenshot similarly you can also record the screen of the android phone using this adb shell screen record and then path where you want to save that uh, mp4 file then you can display all the uh, commands using this adb shell ls slash system slash bin so the commands available in this adb session so all these commands are available in this session that you can execute and uh, finally you can also use this adb shell start abd1 command to start the device so that's how you can uh, list down all the uh, device uh, package names or execute different different adb commands and another command that are very important uh, uh, to identify or find out the main activity from the uh, application or this ones adb shell pm list packages then adb pull name of the uh, application and then apt uh, dump uh, badging calculator dot apk so these commands are used to find the main activity for example once you execute this command it lists down the package name as well as the full path of that particular package so this package uh, a dot apk file is uh, kept in this particular path system slash app and adb pull dot apk this particular command adb pull uh, dot apk this particular command can be used because in this uh, earlier command uh, we know the path of that apk file so you can uh, use this adb pull command to download that apk file and then next we can use this uh, apt command to 
find the launchable activity or the main activity of the particular application so that's how you can uh, use different different adb commands uh, in the uh, that uh, that are used to uh, drive the adb uh, android device if you like this video hit like button and subscribe to my channel hi friends if you find this video useful please hit like button and for more videos please subscribe to my channel and also visit www.softforce.org for more tutorials and updated videos thanks for watching my video